Hey guys, in this one I'm going to play the most popular assassin right now, Saber. Now he's even scarier than before after the introduction of War Axe. But he's a little bit of a double edged sword because he can kill fast but can also get killed extremely fast as well. That's why it's important to know when to engage or else you will be just trading a kill for a kill. If you kill one but they kill you as well, then it will be a 4v4 because 5 minus 1 equals 4. In this match, we are going to have a very pessimistic teammate who probably got scarred for life playing Mobile Legends. I was a little bit under pressure to do well or else he was probably going to end up causing my entire generation. Unfortunately, the early part of the game, I had some technical issue recording, but what happened is that we ended up training 2 for 2. I got 2 assists from those early encounters. Here, I saw that Johe was already really low so I aim my ult towards someone else. You can see how I'm aiming my ult instead of just tapping it. Try not to use your ult on a already guaranteed death target. Saber's damage is seriously absolutely naughty. Once you get War Axe, you can pretty much one shot any DPS in the early game. Our team provided perfect vision, now we know that they are planning to gain top, so we should definitely use the information to our advantage and counter gang them. That's why it's really important that the tanks constantly provide vision for the team, because then we can plan our next move. Even though there are some targets available, you don't just want to ult whoever you see right away without considering the whole situation. 
When you old, you become extremely vulnerable as well. So be smart when too old. Here, I was planning to go for the Eudora, but once I saw Johe turning around, I had to abort the mission right away. Their Johead has been trying to throw someone for a while, so let's kill him before he tries to do any of his shenanigans. With this new build that has tons of penetration and his passive as well, Sabre can actually kill tanks quite easily. I have seen a lot of Saber players sacrificing their own life just to kill a mage or a fighter, but if you are playing him as the jungler, you should only go for the kill when you know you can escape easily afterwards. Mm -hmm. 